Okay, I guess we're going back in then, unless we can somehow get to the top of the roof. Um, yeah, there's some people from work who have accents, like the like the Muslims I was talking about earlier. They have accents. Um, the thing is, like for Canada, and I don't know what part of the world you're in. Um, we have like high like population of just like people who aren't. Um, like straight up Canadians, like we have a lot of immigrants, so it's like, for me, I, it's just like, I might hear an accent, but I don't think much of it, because it's um, uh, come back here. We're so used to having people from different parts of the world. So, for example, like uh, when I play D and D, like we play with like an Australian guy. I know he has an accent, but I don't think much of it. Because I'm like, oh, like, it's just another, like, you know, person from a different part of the world. But, like, thick country accent in particular, I can't think of anyone like that off the top of my head. Welcome back, Karma. Uh, do we want the plasma pistol? No, we don't want that. Oh, I think we have to go inside. Oh, we can't fast travel enemies are nearby. Dang. I was at a friend who has a very thick Jamaican accent and she's cool sometimes. I just like to listen to her voice. Don't take that out of context. Hey, hey man, no, no shame in that. Dude, if you're like, I like listening to this lady's voice because it just sounds good, that's fine, man. I don't think there's any shame in that. Uh, you know, like, accents are very interesting. And it's, it's interesting to think, too, that even though, like, we're all just, like, humans, um... And, like, really, like, we're all the same. It's just, um, amazing how two people of, like, same, like, similar biological makeup can, um, have, uh, like, such interesting differences. Like, so, for example, like, I speak in one way, but then, like, say your Jamaican friend speaks in a very different way, right? Do you want to be in here? Yes, we probably do. Even though, like, we're both humans, right? We both have lungs. We both have, um vocal cords etc etc yet there are there do exist differences between us i try to be careful here because i feel like you know the conversation topic that i'm on is like oh we're dangerously close to racism that's not what i was trying to go for and that's just it. some people like they sound like really good uh, to listen to like uh, one of my favorite act like movie actors is like Michael Caine simply just because like he sounds nice like I like listening to Michael Caine talk also we should sleep in a bed actually if we can why is there a ri oh for fallout I thought you meant like in real life I'm like wait I have a ring around my head um oh because it's an item in fallout that we can have that um that restores HP for us. Or regenerates HP. I looks like purified water. A halo, whatever it is. Yeah, no, it's a halo. I mean, I think you're also right to calling it a, uh, a ring. I'll sleep for an hour. Um, oh, yeah, as I was saying, though, like, Michael Caine just sounds amazing. Like, like I can listen to Michael Caine talk for, like, hours on end. Okay, how much is, like, actually worth taking? Sounds like Sarsaparilla. Why is that floating? Maybe we don't care. When Cyclops closes his eyes momentarily, is it a wink or a blink? See, I think we, um... That's probably the hardest. You can't say both and neither, man. Dude, that's just like... <laughs> a or not A. Both. W excuse me? Uh, it would be a... I call it a blink. See, a wink for me is kind of like... That implies, uh... Um... Uh, a positive interaction on some level. Um, oh, we crashed. It crashed again. Holy. All right. This is insane. Oops. We're going to try this one more time. This is it. Because if you, if you wink at someone, that usually means like either like, oh, like you're there in on the joke. It's flirtatious. Or, um, 
you know, it's like, ah, ha, ha, do you get it? Whereas a blank, like, you just, you just do that, right? So in the context of this question, for the Cyclops, if he's just, um, if he's just standing there and, like, his eyes closed, then, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and say, like, that's, that's just, um, that's a blank. Whereas, like, if the Cyclops, like, looked at me, maybe a little lustfully, and was like, and then I'm like, okay, that's a wink then. Maybe it is a blink, but he closed his eye halfway, and then that's a wink. I mean, like, that could be true, too, but I just don't think that, um... I mean, that's just how I see it. I don't... People might disagree with me. Like, I just, I, that's how I feel the distinction is between, like, the wink and the blink. Though, like, of course, people, like, may disagree with me. And again, like, that's more than all right. Because I feel like a winking and blinking, like, they're, they're very similar to begin with. Like, it's, um... They're not too far removed. It's like comparing like a German Shepherd dog to a Siberian Husky. It's like yes, they're like they are different breeds of dogs and there are differences, but they're also similar in a lot of different ways. It's kind of like winking a blink. That's my hot take, Connors. I don't know how this became an entire thing. Hey, Matt, dude. Sometimes when you're talking and someone says something, you just go on about it. You know, like that's uh. Either the blessing or the curse. Oh, see what I did there? Of just like rambling is that sometimes you take things out of the air, you turn into an interesting conversation, or maybe that it turns out that me talking about winking and blinking was actually really boring. You guys are saying like, why is he still talking about this? Like, talk more about the like political unrest of World War Two. But again, I don't have much on that. The only thing I have are ideas. Uh, I don't think we want any of this. Oh, hello. See a nerd. Alright, he's down for... A Braxo Cleaner. Why he has that, I don't know. He only had a hatchet, too. Alright, we need to figure out how to get up there. Do you prefer dogs or cats? Um, I am more of a dog person than a cat person. Though cats are great, too. I, um... Oh, the cuckoo's nest. Let's we'll go there. Oh, we have to go in here. Personally, like, dude, so I think cats and dogs are both, like, legitimate options. Like, some people say, hey, I like cats. That's awesome. People say, I like dogs. That's good, too. I really like both, though. I prefer dogs slightly more. Uh, because I think I have more of a um, uh, personality that's suited for dogs. Oh. Yes, we will take that. Like, cats can be great, but, like, dogs, from my experience, are very friendly, which I really appreciate that. And I like dogs, too, because, like, you can take them out for walks and stuff. Um, and you can technically walk a cat as well. I think, for the most part, like, they're very different pets, though. Like, the, the big dogs I had, uh, they were lovely, but you can have them, like, on your bed because, like, they would just make a mess of it. Um, whereas a cat, like, a cat can sleep on your bed and, like, you can, like, pet the cat. cat can snuggle with you. Like, if I had a cat, a cat could sit in my lap right now. Gee, man, Carmat's just, like, resting his mind after, um... <laughs> destroying my, uh, understanding of reality so badly. So there's my answer on dogs and cats. I do prefer dogs, but I think cats are very wonderful, too. Like, it's, like, I'm not actually at the point, like, right now in my life where I'm, I'm debating whether or not I actually want a cat. If that gives, like, any context about, like, how I like both of them. A local map. Alright, so we just need to go over here, then, I think. Though, some people, like, they get really, like, worked up. Do they enshrine this? Oh, the toaster. There we go. Perfect. There's a lot of toasters nearby them, too. That's ominous. Um, some people really get riled up about cats. Like some people like just hate cats. Some people just like don't like dogs. Um, I, I think more often than not, most people are inclined to really. So okay, this is where we're gonna like, go on a bit of a tangent, which I guess that's what we've been doing off stream. These these are great homes. Force fields can only be disrupted by a specific frequency. frequency. Oh, we need a shovel. If anyone has found the frequency, last seen around X8, let the dome know at once. Uh, okay, and Carmen, I see your question, right? 
you, you're blowing the fabrics of reality, man. Um, you know, for cats and dogs, like, you always can, like, turn into, like, left wing versus right wing for politics, and, like, people have, like, similar reactions, you know? Some people are like, yeah, I can understand, like, both policies. Or, you know, I understand, like, you know, cats and dogs, where some people are like, dude, man, be a cat fan or get out, or, like, be a dog person and get out. So, um, you know, very Fallout crashed again. Holy good grief. Okay, well, um, I think that's a sign that maybe we should end the stream here then. If, uh, Fallout's gonna keep, uh, is going to keep crashing on us. Um, yeah, so I'm going to end the stream here. Thank you all for watching. I had a great time. Hopefully you guys did as well. And uh, I hope to stream next week, probably starting around the summertime. And yeah, until then, I'll see you guys later.